Welcome to my channel. Benny the Kitten. Today listen about Spooky Adventures on Halloween Lane. Once upon a time in a small town named Pumpkinville. Halloween was the most anticipated and magical night of the year. Every street was adorned with spooky decorations. And children dressed up in costumes, eagerly awaiting their trick-or-treat adventure. In the heart of Pumpkinville was a magical street known as Halloween Lane, where all the excitement unfolded. On Halloween Lane, the houses were decorated with eerie lights, friendly ghosts, and grinning pumpkins that glowed in the dark. In one of these houses lived a curious little ghost named Casper. Casper was not your typical ghost. He loved making friends and spreading happiness. He always looked forward to Halloween as it was a night when he could have the most fun. This Halloween was extra special because Casper had a surprise planned for all the children on Halloween Lane. He had discovered a mysterious pumpkin patch that was said to hold the secret to the sweetest treats in town. On the night of Halloween, the moon shone brightly and the stars twinkled with excitement. Casper, donned in his favorite friendly ghost costume, set out with a small group of eager trick-or-treaters, including Tommy the werewolf, Lily the witch, and Benny the pirate. As they ventured down Halloween Lane, the air was filled with giggles and excitement. The houses were decorated with spiderwebs, skeletons, and friendly monsters handing out candy to the children. Casper led the group to the mysterious pumpkin patch. The pumpkins were indeed special. Each one had a magic glow and whispered secrets of sweetness. Casper, using his magical ghostly powers, summoned the pumpkin spirits to share their delightful treats with the children. The pumpkins gleefully shared their candy with the children, and they danced and sang under the moonlight. The children's bags were filled with the most delicious candies they had ever tasted. As the night came to a close, Casper thanked the pumpkin spirits for their generosity. The children were overjoyed and thanked Casper for the unforgettable Halloween adventure. They promised to return to Halloween Lane the following year for more fun and excitement. From that day on, Halloween Lane became a favorite haunt for all the children in Pumpkinville. And Casper's kind heart and playful spirit made every Halloween a truly magical and spooktacular night. And so, in the heart of Pumpkinville, the spirit of Halloween lived on, bringing smiles and laughter to all the children year after year. Patch's Pumpkin Adventure, A Halloween Tale Once upon a time in the small town of Spookville, Halloween was the most magical night of the year. Little Timmy, a brave and curious boy, lived in a cozy house near the eerie forest. One Halloween night, Timmy and his dog, Buster, set out for a thrilling adventure. As the moon cast spooky shadows, they ventured into the haunted woods. They stumbled upon a mysterious pumpkin patch with glowing pumpkins that whispered secrets of the past. Suddenly, the pumpkins came alive, forming a friendly pumpkin creature named Patch. Patch explained that the magic of Halloween had awakened them. Together, they danced and giggled under the moonlit sky. Patch granted Timmy a special pumpkin lantern that could light the way and keep them safe. 
With the enchanted lantern leading the way, they explored a magical realm full of delightful surprises and friendly ghosts. When the night was over, Timmy and Buster returned home, cherishing the memories of their Halloween adventure. The magic of that night stayed with them, reminding them that sometimes the most enchanting experiences happen when you face your fears and embrace the magic of the unknown. Once upon a time, in a quaint little village nestled between rolling hills, there was a magical pumpkin patch known as the Enchanted Pumpkin Patch. Every year, as the leaves turned golden and the air grew crisp, the pumpkins in this patch came alive and prepared for a grand Halloween celebration. In this patch, there was a special pumpkin named Peter who was the kindest and brightest pumpkin of them all. Peter had a warm orange glow and a friendly smile that made everyone feel at ease. He was a little different from the other pumpkins. He dreamed of exploring the world beyond the patch. One Halloween night, when the moon was full and the stars sparkled brightly, the enchantment that cloaked the pumpkin patch began to shimmer and dance. The pumpkins awakened, ready for their yearly Halloween festivities. Peter decided that this was his chance to go on an adventure and see the world beyond the pumpkin patch. He rolled out of his spot, leaving a note for his pumpkin friends explaining his longing to explore and promising to return by dawn. Peter rolled down the pumpkin patch, through the village, and into the streets, where children dressed in costumes roamed happily, trick-or-treating from door to door. Peter marveled at the creativity and excitement of Halloween. He met a little girl named Lily, who wore a fairy costume. Lily's eyes lit up when she saw Peter. Oh, what a delightful pumpkin you are, she exclaimed. Would you like to join me on my Halloween adventure? Peter agreed, and together they wandered through the village, spreading joy and laughter. Peter's warm glow made everyone smile, and the children admired him. As the night went on, Peter and Lily encountered a spooky haunted house. With courage, they ventured inside, finding it filled with friendly ghosts and playful spirits. They danced and laughed, making new friends. As the clock struck midnight, Peter knew it was time to head back to the enchanted pumpkin patch. Lily wished him farewell, promising to visit the patch next year. With a happy heart, Peter rolled back to the pumpkin patch just as the first light of dawn began to break. His pumpkin friends were eager to hear about his adventure, and Peter excitedly shared his Halloween night escapade. From that day on, Peter became a legend in the Enchanted Pumpkin Patch. Each year, he looked forward to Halloween, sharing stories and spreading happiness with children who embrace the magic of the pumpkin patch. And so, the enchanted pumpkin patch continued to be a source of joy and wonder, enchanting all who visited during the magical season of Halloween. The Enchanted Halloween Ball Once upon a time, in a quaint little village, there was a magical forest known as Whimsywood. Whimsywood was a place filled with mystical creatures, talking animals, and wonders beyond imagination. Every year, the forest celebrated a grand event called the Enchanted Halloween Ball. This year was extra special as it marked the 100th year of the extraordinary Halloween ball. 
All the magical beings were buzzing with excitement, preparing their costumes and decorations for the grand celebration. In the heart of Whimsywood, there lived a young witch named Willow. Willow was a kind-hearted witch who loved to spread happiness and laughter wherever she went. She had a cat named Whiskers, who was her loyal companion and always by her side. Willow and Whiskers were determined to make this year's Halloween ball the most enchanting one ever. They spent weeks crafting elaborate costumes and decorating their home with glowing pumpkins, enchanted lanterns, and colorful banners. On the night of the Halloween ball, the forest was illuminated with the soft glow of fireflies and enchanted lanterns. Creatures of all shapes and sizes gathered at the magical clearing where the celebration was held. Willow and Whiskers arrived at the ball, adorned in their most splendid costumes. Willow wore a shimmering gown adorned with stars and moons, and Whiskers was dressed as a dashing wizard. The festivities began with a magical dance, and Willow and Whiskers swirled and twirled with the other creatures. The music was enchanting, filling the air with a joyful rhythm. As the night went on, they encountered a friendly ghost named Casper who had a special gift, a magical pumpkin. The pumpkin could grant a single wish to whoever possessed it. Casper decided to gift it to Willow, acknowledging her kindness and love for the magical forest. Willow made her wish. I wish for the magic of love and laughter to fill the hearts of all creatures in Whimsywood forever. In an instant, the pumpkin shimmered and released a burst of magical sparkles, spreading love and laughter throughout the forest. The creatures felt an overwhelming sense of joy and unity, and their spirits were lifted. The celebration continued with even more magic, laughter, and dancing. Willow and Whiskers were overjoyed to see the forest filled with happiness and love. And so, the 100th Enchanted Halloween Ball became a legendary event in Whimsywood. And the magic of love and laughter remained in the hearts of all its inhabitants, spreading joy throughout the forest for generations to come. The Enchanted Halloween Pumpkin Once upon a time, in a quaint little village, there was a magical pumpkin patch. Every year, as Halloween approached, the pumpkins in this patch would transform into enchanting beings and come to life for one special night of fun and adventure. In this magical pumpkin patch, there was a young pumpkin named Peter who was eager to experience his first Halloween. He was a cheerful, round pumpkin with a bright orange color and a happy smile. As the moon rose on the night of Halloween, the pumpkin patch started to glow with an ethereal light. The pumpkins awakened and began their magical transformation. Peter felt a tingling sensation as he started to wiggle and wobble, finally coming to life. The pumpkin patch was filled with laughter and excitement as all the pumpkins gathered together. They formed a circle and decided to embark on a journey to the nearby village to spread Halloween joy. As they approached the village, they noticed children dressed in imaginative costumes, going from house to house, trick or treating. Peter was amazed by the creativity and joy that filled the air. He couldn't wait to be a part of this enchanting night. The pumpkins huddled together and used their magical powers to create a beautiful, glowing carriage made of vines and leaves. Peter felt a surge of excitement as he hopped into the carriage with his fellow pumpkin friends. The enchanted pumpkin carriage glided through the village, 
spreading a trail of shimmering sparkles in its way. The children in the village gasped in awe as they saw the magical carriage approaching. The pumpkins giggled with delight, knowing they were bringing joy to the children. Peter and his pumpkin friends decided to surprise the children by giving them extra special treats. With a wave of their magical stems, they conjured up baskets filled with delicious candies and treats for the children. The children's faces lit up with joy as they received the magical gifts. The pumpkins continued their journey, making stops at each house and spreading Halloween cheer. They danced, sang, and shared laughter, filling the village with a magical atmosphere. As the night came to an end, the pumpkins returned to their patch, exhausted but overjoyed. Peter felt a sense of accomplishment and happiness for having made the children's Halloween so special. The magic of Halloween faded away as the sun began to rise. And the pumpkins returned to their pumpkin form, falling into a peaceful slumber. From that day on, the village cherished the memory of the enchanted pumpkin carriage and the joy it brought to their Halloween night. Peter became a legend in the pumpkin patch, and every year, the pumpkins eagerly awaited the enchanting night of Halloween to come alive once more and bring happiness to the children. And so, the tale of Peter, the enchanted Halloween pumpkin, became a cherished story that was passed down through generations, reminding everyone of the magic and wonder that Halloween brings. The Halloween Magic Pumpkin Once upon a time, in a small, cozy village nestled between rolling hills, there was a magical tradition that everyone looked forward to every year, Halloween. The whole village would come together, young and old, to celebrate this enchanting holiday. The heart of the village was a cheerful, pumpkin-loving girl named Lily. She was known for her endless enthusiasm and creative ideas when it came to Halloween. She had a special talent for carving the most extraordinary pumpkins the village had ever seen. Each year, her house was the spookiest and most mesmerizing of all. But this Halloween was different. Lily had heard whispers of an ancient legend, a magical pumpkin said to grant the one who carved it a wish. All it needed was to be found in the heart of the mysterious, enchanted pumpkin forest on the night of Halloween. With excitement bubbling inside her, Lily set off on a thrilling adventure, determined to find this legendary pumpkin. As the sun dipped below the horizon on Halloween night, casting an eerie orange glow across the village. Lily ventured into the pumpkin forest. The forest was dark and shrouded in mystery, but her heart was filled with courage. Armed with her trusty lantern, she took careful steps among the gnarled trees and strange, whispering breezes. Lily searched for what seemed like hours, her lantern casting eerie shadows on the trees. She heard the gentle rustling of leaves and the hoot of an owl. But her determination never wavered. Finally, deep within the forest, she stumbled upon a glimmering, radiant pumpkin, different from any she had ever seen. With bated breath, she carefully carved an intricate design onto the pumpkin's surface. As the final stroke was made, the pumpkin began to glow even brighter, bathing the forest in an enchanting light. A warm voice echoed through the trees. I am the Halloween Magic Pumpkin. Your wish shall be granted, but it must be selfless. 
Lily thought long and hard. She knew that her village needed something special to make this Halloween the most memorable one yet. With unwavering resolve, she made her wish. I wish for this Halloween to bring joy, happiness, and laughter to every child in the village, now and forever. The enchanted pumpkin shone even brighter, and in a brilliant burst of light. Its magic spread throughout the entire village. Suddenly, every pumpkin in the village turned into a lantern, casting a warm and inviting glow. Delicious treats appeared on doorsteps, and laughter filled the air. As the villagers awoke to this wondrous sight, they realized that Lily's wish had come true. Halloween had become a holiday of unity, sharing, and endless joy. The legend of the Halloween magic pumpkin lived on for generations. And the villagers knew that the true magic of Halloween lay in the kindness of their hearts. And so, in that little village nestled between the rolling hills, Halloween was forevermore a night of enchantment, laughter, and the spirit of sharing. And all of this was made possible by a brave, kind-hearted girl named Lily and the Halloween magic pumpkin that taught them the true meaning of the holiday. The Friendly Ghosts Halloween Parade Once upon a time, in a small town called Spookington, Halloween was the most exciting day of the year. The entire town came alive with decorations, costumes, and the promise of candy. Spookington was known for its friendly and mischievous ghosts. And this Halloween was going to be a spooky surprise like no other. In a cozy, cobweb-covered mansion on the outskirts of town lived five adorable ghosts. Casper! Wendy, Gus, Boo, and Spooky. They were different from other ghosts because they were not the least bit scary. In fact, they were known for their kindness and playfulness. As Halloween approached, the five friendly ghosts gathered to plan something special. They wanted to share their love for Halloween with the children of Spookington. Let's put on a Halloween parade that will be remembered for ages. Casper, the leader of the group, exclaimed. So, the friendly ghosts set to work. They painted pumpkins stitched costumes, and crafted colorful decorations. Wendy, the artistic ghost, painted a large pumpkin with a smiling face, while Gus, the mischievous one, made spooky sound effects that would add to the fun. On Halloween night, the whole town eagerly awaited the parade. Families gathered on the streets with their children. Wearing costumes ranging from witches and wizards to superheroes and animals. The moon shone brightly in the night sky as a crisp autumn breeze rustled the leaves. At the stroke of midnight, the friendly ghosts began their Halloween parade. Casper led the way, floating with grace while holding a glowing lantern. Wendy twirled and danced in her ballerina costume, making everyone smile. Gus played pranks on the spectators by gently tickling them with his ghostly fingers, causing laughter to fill the air. Boo and Spooky, dressed as friendly pirates, handed out candy to the children, making sure everyone had a sweet treat. The townsfolk were amazed by the friendly ghosts' parade. Instead of fright, they were filled with joy and wonder. The children giggled and danced along with the ghosts, 
and the parents clapped and cheered. The parade continued through the streets of Spookington, spreading happiness and Halloween spirit wherever it went. As the parade came to an end, the friendly ghosts made a promise to return every Halloween and continue their tradition of bringing joy to the town. The children of Spookington, now with hearts full of delight, eagerly awaited each year's Halloween parade. From that day on, Halloween in Spookington was no longer just a spooky night. It was a night of magic, laughter, and friendship. All thanks to the five friendly ghosts who proved that Halloween could be fun and heartwarming for everyone. And so, the tale of the Friendly Ghosts Halloween Parade became a cherished story in Spookington. A reminder that Halloween was a time for smiles, not scares, and a day to celebrate the magic of friendship. The Enchanted Halloween Potion Once upon a time, in a small village nestled between the tall, Spooky trees, there lived a curious little witch named Willow. Willow wasn't like other witches. She was kind-hearted and had a passion for helping others. Halloween was her favorite time of the year. For it was when she could use her magical skills to make people smile. One crisp October morning. Willow decided to brew a special potion that would bring a touch of magic to her village's Halloween celebration. She knew that her potion would need to be extraordinary. So she set off on a journey to collect rare and magical ingredients. First, she ventured deep into the enchanted forest where she gathered the glittering dewdrops from the morning grass. These dewdrops were as clear as diamonds and had the power to make the night sky twinkle with an otherworldly glow. Next, she climbed to the highest peak of the spooky mountain, where she found a nest of feathers from the mythical night owl. The night owl's feathers were said to bring sweet dreams to anyone who wore them. Willow continued her journey by crossing the misty marshlands to gather the petals of the phantom rose. These roses only bloomed under the light of the full moon and were known to make people invisible. Finally, she visited the friendly talking spiders in the whispering woods to get a vial of their laughter. The laughter of the spiders had the power to make people burst into joyous giggles. With all her ingredients in hand, Willow returned to her cozy cottage. She stirred, mixed, and chanted incantations over her cauldron until the potion was complete. It shimmered in the most enchanting shades of orange and purple, filling the air with a delightful aroma. As the sun dipped below the horizon on Halloween night, Willow poured her magical potion into a crystal goblet. She carried it to the village square, where everyone was gathered for the annual Halloween costume parade. Children and adults alike were dressed as witches, ghosts, and monsters. When Willow offered the potion to the first person, they took a sip and were instantly surrounded by a warm, soft glow. The night owl feathers turned their costumes into the most beautiful outfits. And they felt as though they were floating on a cloud of dreams. The second person to sip the potion disappeared from sight, causing peals of laughter to erupt from the crowd. It was as though they had become invisible. 
and their friends tried to guess where they were hiding. One by one, the villagers sipped the potion and were filled with wonder and delight. Halloween had never been so magical and joyful. The night was filled with laughter, dancing, and endless fun. Willa's enchanted Halloween potion had turned an ordinary celebration into a night of pure enchantment. As the moon shone brightly overhead, the villagers knew that this Halloween would be a memory they'd cherish forever. Thanks to the kindness and creativity of their little witch friend. And so, with hearts full of gratitude, they celebrated Halloween under the light of the magical moon. Creating a night to remember for all the children of the village for years to come. It was a Halloween filled with enchantment, thanks to Willow's special potion and her big, loving heart. The Halloween Adventure of Spooky the Ghost Once upon a time in the enchanted land of Frightville, Halloween was the most magical night of the year. The town was filled with giggling goblins, mirthful monsters, and jubilant jack-o'-lanterns. But at the heart of Frightville lived Spooky, a friendly little ghost who was different from all the other creatures. Spooky was not scary at all. In fact, he was quite the opposite. He was the ghost who couldn't spook. His transparent appearance and his boo sounded more like boo-hoo. The other monsters would laugh and say, Spooky, you're not scary enough for Halloween. Spooky wished he could be as frightening as his friends, but he just couldn't manage it. However, he had a heart full of kindness and a desire to make Halloween special for everyone. One year, as the moon rose high in the night sky, Spooky had an idea. He decided to go on an adventure to bring Halloween cheer to the humans in the nearby village. Spooky knew that humans sometimes got scared on Halloween, and he wanted to make them smile instead. He floated past the haunted forest, over the spooky swamp, and through the eerie graveyard. Spooky felt his heart race with excitement. He finally reached the village, and he began to visit each house, leaving behind small treats and decorating them with colorful candies and friendly notes. The children in the village were amazed. Instead of frightful tricks, they found delightful surprises on their doorsteps. Spooky simple acts of kindness turned fear into fun, and the children laughed and cheered with delight. Word spread quickly about the friendly ghost, and the entire village welcomed Spooky with open arms. Children and parents joined him on his Halloween adventure, painting pumpkins, telling ghost stories, and dancing to eerie, enchanting tunes. As the night drew to a close, Spooky felt a warmth in his heart that he had never felt before. He realized that he didn't need to be scary to make Halloween special. Being kind, friendly, and spreading joy was the best way to celebrate this enchanting night. From that Halloween forward, 
Spooky's adventures became a tradition in the village. Every year, he would bring happiness, not haunts, to the people of Frightville and the nearby village. And Halloween became a night of laughter, joy, and unforgettable memories. And so, children, the tale of Spooky the Ghost teaches us that Halloween is not just about being scary, but also about spreading happiness and making magical memories with the people we care about. Whether you're a ghost or a human, kindness and love are the most powerful magic of all.